All right, I'm going to talk about why baseball players have an easy time transitioning into disc golf. I personally used to play baseball a lot. Uh, I used to actually be like a two-season kind of player, meaning I would play spring league and summer league. This went on until about sophomore, junior year of high school. Uh, But I'm going to get into uh, some of the mechanics of why it's so easy, and we're going to talk about forehand. So when you take a look at some of these uh, swings, I want you to look at where my right hand position is and my right elbow. So you can see that I pop out my elbow right before I swing, and then I tuck it in towards my hip as I'm swinging. Um, This kind of creates power. It uh, helps you drive down on the baseball bat. And you're going to see a different look at it right here. Uh, And you can really just kind of see how my right elbow pops off and uh, goes into it. And then as you look at this, you can kind of see uh, how that goes into a forehand on disc golf. You pop out your elbow, and then as you're going to drive the disc forward, you bring your elbow into uh, your hip. And now, uh, other than that, we're going to talk about why some baseball players will play disc golf and they'll uh, forehand righty, but they'll backhand lefty. I want you to look at now where my left hand position is. We're going to talk about, um, you know, that's probably not the best uh, look, but Philo Brathwaite, a pro disc golfer, uh, says that on his upshots, he'll bring the disc up. And that helps him to, uh, he'll bring it up to his shoulders or so, and that helps him to uh, stay looking at the target and uh, brings him a little more power. So if you look at my uh, left hand now, you can see that it's about shoulder height. And as I'm bringing it forward, I'm snapping my elbow out. And that's probably why you'll see uh, some of these baseball players who play disc golf uh, kind of, Uh, forehand righty and backhand lefty if you're an ambidextrous uh, baseball batter that's really good to transition because obviously you want to be able to forehand righty and backhand righty obviously because you can get two different shapes on your shots Um, but this was just a little look into what you can see in a baseball player and why a baseball player who's never played disc golf before might be able to go out and crush 350 plus forehands. So thank you.